In the heart of a small, close-knit community, nestled amidst rolling hills, lived the McIntyre family. Samuel McIntyre, a proud and stoic man in his late 50s, was a well-respected member of the community. However, hidden beneath his respectable facade lay a deep-rooted prejudice that poisoned his soul. He held a disdainful belief that people of different races were inferior, a belief he instilled in his children, including his daughter, Emily. Emily, a compassionate and open-minded young woman in her mid-twenties, had always questioned her father's views. Her heart yearned for a world where love and acceptance reigned supreme. One fateful summer day, while attending a local community event, Emily found herself inexplicably drawn to a charismatic young man named Malik. Malik, a talented artist and activist, had moved to the community to escape the crowded city life. He carried with him a vibrancy and passion that captured the attention of all who crossed his path. When Emily and Malik's eyes met, an electric connection sparked between them. They soon discovered a shared love for the arts, and their friendship blossomed into an undeniable love. Word of Emily's relationship with Malik reached Samuel's ears like a piercing siren. The color drained from his face as he contemplated the unthinkable, a relationship between his daughter and a black man. Consumed by prejudice and fear, he forbade Emily from seeing Malik, demanding she cut off all ties. But Emily's spirit refused to bow to her father's misguided beliefs. She knew she had found true love, a love that transcended the shackles of prejudice. As tensions rose within the McIntyre household, Emily pleaded with her father to open his heart and see the love she and Malik shared. Samuel, however, was blinded by his prejudice, unable to fathom the possibility of a life beyond his deeply ingrained biases. In his stubbornness, he disowned Emily, severing the fragile thread connecting them. Emily and Malik refused to allow Samuel's prejudice to dampen their spirits. They stood strong, supporting one another through the emotional turmoil that threatened to consume them. Their love became a beacon of hope and resilience, inspiring those around them to challenge their own prejudices. Emily's younger brother, Jacob, found himself torn between his father's beliefs and his sister's happiness. Witnessing the devastating consequences of prejudice firsthand, he grappled with his own conflicted emotions. Jacob embarked on a journey of self-discovery, determined to confront his own biases and find the courage to stand against his father's hatred. One stormy evening, as the rain cascaded down like tears from the heavens, a community meeting was held to address the division that had taken root. Samuel, bitter and obstinate, faced a room filled with individuals who had once blindly followed his lead. However, his fortress of prejudice began to crumble as story after story of love, compassion, and forgiveness unfolded before him. Samuel, burdened by guilt and regret, finally confronted the shattered pieces of his fractured family. In a moment of vulnerability, he reached out to Emily, begging for her forgiveness and vowing to change his ways. Through her love and unwavering strength, Emily extended an olive branch, allowing her father the opportunity to mend their broken bond. Samuel's transformation became a catalyst for change within the community. Inspired by his willingness to confront his own prejudice, many others began to question their long-held beliefs. Time passed, and the McIntyre family slowly pieced together the fragments of their lives. Samuel, now a humbler man, dedicated his days to challenging prejudice and fostering understanding within the community. Emily and Malik's love story became a symbol of hope, reminding everyone that love could conquer even the most entrenched hatred. The power of love, forgiveness, and the unwavering determination to challenge prejudice shattered the chains that had bound the McIntyre family and their community. It served as a powerful reminder that the color of one's skin held no bearing on the capacity to love and be loved. Years passed, and the community gradually began to heal from the wounds of prejudice. Samuel's transformation had a profound impact on those around him, and his advocacy for equality and acceptance garnered respect and admiration. The community became more inclusive, embracing diversity and celebrating the beauty of different cultures. Emily and Malik's love story stood strong against the test of time. Their relationship thrived, deepening with each passing day. Together, they faced the challenges that life presented, always supporting one another with unwavering love and understanding. Their bond became a beacon of hope for others who yearned to break free from the chains of prejudice. As the community flourished, new generations were raised with a different perspective. Samuel, now a wise old man, took it upon himself to educate the youth about the dangers of prejudice. He shared his own story of transformation, highlighting the importance of empathy and the power of love to overcome hatred. His words resonated with the young minds, planting seeds of compassion and understanding that would shape their futures. Emily and Malik, now married and with children of their own, passed down the lessons they had learned to the next generation. Their children grew up in a home filled with love, acceptance, and respect for all individuals, regardless of their background. 
the community organized events and initiatives that brought people from different races and backgrounds together. Festivals, art exhibitions, and cultural exchanges became commonplace, fostering a sense of unity and harmony among community members. Through these interactions, deep-rooted prejudices continued to crumble, replaced by connections and friendships that defied societal boundaries. Samuel, now in the twilight of his life, witnessed the transformation he had longed for. His heart swelled with pride and gratitude as he saw the community he once divided come together as one. As Samuel's time drew near, he reflected on his journey, filled with both regret and redemption. He took solace in knowing that he had made amends with his daughter and had contributed to a community that was more compassionate and inclusive. Samuel's passing was mourned by the entire community, a testament to the impact he had made in his later years. Emily and Molly carried on Samuel's legacy, continuing his work and striving to create a world free from prejudice and discrimination. They dedicated themselves to advocating for equality, fighting against systemic racism, and nurturing love and acceptance in all aspects of life. The lessons learned from the journey of the McIntyre family had permeated every corner, guiding the actions and beliefs of its inhabitants. Though the scars of the past remained, they served as a reminder of the collective journey from darkness to light. And so, the story of the racist father who initially rejected his daughter's love due to his prejudice had evolved into a tale of redemption, forgiveness, and the triumph of love over bigotry. It taught the world that even the most deeply ingrained beliefs can be challenged and changed, and that compassion and empathy have the power to reshape not only individuals but entire communities. The McIntyre family's story became a living testament to the fact that love knows no boundaries, and that the bonds formed through acceptance and understanding are the ones that can truly heal and unite a fractured world.